there is an opioid epidemic in the United States, and it shows no signs of slowing down. This is a major public health crisis. The United States comprises 4% of the world's population. However, we consume 80% of the world's opioids. Unfortunately, the United States is not better at managing pain than other countries. Currently, 91 Americans die each day due to opioid-related overdoses, comparable to four 747 plane crashes each month. The majority of strategies focus on treating abuse rather than preventing it. But prevention is key in the fight against opioid abuse. Opioids are often prescribed for pain following surgery, but are often misused by patients to treat other symptoms, such as depression, insomnia, arthritis, headaches, and fibromyalgia. Among patients not using opioids before surgery, the most common post-operative complication is becoming a new chronic opioid user, more common than wound infection, heart attack, and blood clot. Between 5 to 8 percent of patients not taking opioids before surgery become opioid users chronically, even for very minor surgeries. For some surgeries, it is up to 20 percent. The majority of patients stop using opioids soon after surgery. However, many leave their unused opioids unprotected in their homes. These opioids get into our communities with devastating effects. The lack of education, guidelines, and safe disposal options for opioid medications further fuel this crisis. The Michigan Opioid Prescribing and Engagement Network, Michigan Open, is led by the Institute for Healthcare Policy and Innovation at the University of Michigan in collaboration with physicians, nurses, and mid-level practitioners throughout the state and is made possible by public and private payers. Michigan Open aims to raise awareness through education, create interventions to reduce post-operative opioid prescribing and patient consumption, and create a cycle for continuous improvement. Michigan Open aims to ensure appropriate acute pain care while protecting patients and communities. Our platform will provide practical and generalizable strategies that can be applied across the United States and a novel pathway centered on prevention to end the opioid epidemic.